We want to get back to our breaking news now of a double shooting outside of Mandina's restaurant in Mid City. Andres Fuentes is live with the very latest tonight from the scene. Meg, Lauren, right now, they're letting customers out of Mandina. We're just outside the restaurant, and we ran into a few of them who gave us a little more details of what it was like around 8 o'clock when this double shooting happened. Now, we do know from customers that it was a busboy or a server that was shot and killed right outside the restaurant while it was open and busy just after Jazz Fest. And now uh, the, the scene outside the restaurant is, is, is nothing but NOPD presence right now as they still try to investigate this. Uh, witnesses tell me that it was automatic gunfire that shot into the restaurant and one of those bullets hit uh, a woman a customer who was inside of the restaurant uh, one of the customers told me that there were actually two doctors inside of the restaurant that were able to uh, give her emergency treatment at the time and potentially saved her life NOPD tells me that uh, they rushed that woman all the way to the hospital and right now she is in stable condition we're still working on details about a suspect or a motive of this uh, shooting but uh, again we did speak to customers and here's a little bit of what went down uh, during this shooting we just we were standing outside we were at a dinner party for a birthday we just got seated and then we heard you know it didn't sound like a pop like you would think and I saw smoke out through the windows and then the woman that was sitting directly behind me I don't know her name uh, was apparently the woman that took the bullet through the wall of the front of the store so she was inside she was she we was were inside, inside yeah. yes we were just seated for our dinner party can you confirm, was it three people shot we're hearing? Maybe the security guard also got shot. I can't confirm any of that. I just know the woman behind me took a bullet through the front wall, and there were two doctors that were in there, and they immediately got on there and did compressions to control the bleeding. And we got whisked out of the area, and she was taken out the side exit. Gotcha. Let me ask you, sir, you know, that woman actually lives. She's in stable condition in the hospital. How does that kind of feel that, that those doctors really did a number? Well... Eternally grateful, and it's just, I'm glad she's good. Our uh, friend who was throwing the party, it's her 75th birthday, and she's devastated, I'm sure. She went to the hospital with her friend. And so just to recap, if you're just tuning in, there was a double shooting outside of Mandina's uh, around 8.20 this evening. A man was shot and killed. We're, we're hearing from customers that it was a busboy or a server who was shot and killed on the sidewalk. Uh, bullets actually went through the restaurant, shot a woman who was uh, dining at the restaurant as well. But she's in stable condition. She was rushed to the hospital. And we are still working on more details about this shooting uh, at this time. But Canal Street is also shut down in this stretch uh, around Cortez and Carrollton. Uh, so if you are going downtown toward, uh, through Canal, that, that intersection or, or that section of streets, I should say, uh, is shut down. The streetcar also shut down while NOPD still investigates this shooting. Uh, but so we have more information about what happened here this evening. We'll be updating you both on air and online. But for now, reporting live, Andres Fuentes, Fox 8, Local First.